A trip to the moon may be on the horizon as Astrobotic, a company in the United States, has just revealed a robotic lunar lander that it aims to launch this very year. All said to be the first lander to touch down on moon since the Apollo mission. Here's a detailed report. It's been nearly 50 years since the Apollo mission. The third human spaceflight mission by the United States in the year 1972. A program carried out by NASA that succeeded in ferrying humans to the surface of the moon. It's been a while, but another trip to the moon may not be too far away. That is because Astrobotic, a Pennsylvania company, has now unveiled its lunar lander, the Peregrine. This is the lander. This is the team. This complex looking machine is a little over six feet tall. The lander comes equipped with five main engines on its base and has been especially designed to take payloads like those from NASA. The Peregrine robotic lunar lander will play a pivotal role in its mission to the moon, says NASA administrator Bill Nelson. We're going back to the moon with unmanned landers that are commercial landers. And this summer, we're going back with the largest rocket ever, the space launch system with its spacecraft Orion on the top. This is a test mission. It will be uncrewed, and in two years, uh, we will have a crew that will go to the moon, and a year after that, we will land on the moon with the first woman and the next man. So brace up, because the Peregrine lander may just be your ticket to the moon. Bureau Report, We On, World is One. We On, now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.